again. My name is Gabe Zona. You know, I posted a video this morning. And I talked about James Earl Ray and the assassination of Martin Luther King. Well, I believe it was another one of those operations done by our government. James Earl Ray, I believe, was a patsy. They always find an adequate patsy, don't they? The most recent patsy is Nicholas Cruz. You ever wonder how Nicholas Cruz could have been walking down the hall with a girl who turns to him and says, I thought it was you that was doing the shooting. She was walking down the hall with Nicholas Cruz right after the shooting took place and she turned to Nicholas Cruz and said that. Yet the government is still accusing him of being the shooter. Not those four men that left a crime scene <laughs> after dumping a duffel bag in the back of a Ford F-150 hmm? and leaving an active shooting scene. Folks, you just have to look at the pieces of the puzzle and you'll understand why a lot of these murders or assassinations take place. James O'Ray was a patsy. He was killed to cover up the killing of Martin Luther King. You think not? Well, you're entitled to an opinion, as I am to mine. John Lennon was killed by our government because he was a peace activist. And that was during the height of the Vietnam conflict. And John Lennon was sending the wrong kind of messages out to the American people, the kind that the government didn't want those messages being sent out. Same reason that Martin Luther King got whacked when he said the speech, I have a dream. He too had a large following, which resulted in the riddance of the Jim Crow laws a few years later. Folks, you can't make this stuff up. Anyone that speaks out against what this government's trying to do, they get whacked. John Lennon got whacked. Martin Luther King got whacked. JFK got whacked. JFK Jr. got whacked because he would have been the senator from New York. Hillary never would have won against him. He had to be disposed of, and he was. This plane was blown out of the sky. You can't make this stuff up, folks. They did a search for the wreckage and the bodies, and the Atlantic Ocean. They never do that for you or for me or for anybody else. The reason they did a search is because they couldn't have the body surface showing that they were blown out of the sky. And as soon as bodies were recovered, they were cremated. <laughs> Are you sort of getting the picture? Anyone that has a large platform that speaks out against this government gets whacked. You've heard the expression, the squeaky wheel gets the grease. Well, in this case, those people that make a lot of noise don't get the grease. They get a bullet or they get blown out of the sky. Do your own research. Let me know what you come up with. You might want to repost this on all your social media accounts. You might want to pass along to your like-minded friends. Ask them to do the same. Thanks for listening.